In this example, we're given a relation in the form of a chart, and we're asked to find the inverse of the relation, then graph the relation and its inverse. To find the inverse of a relation, we simply switch the x and y values in each point. In other words, the point 1, negative 4 becomes negative 4, 1. The point 2, 0 becomes 0, 2. The point 3, 1 becomes 1, 3. And the point 6, negative 1 becomes negative 1, 6. Next, we're asked to graph the relation and its inverse. So let's first graph the relation. Notice that the relation contains the points 1, negative 4, 2, 0, 3, 1, and 6, negative 1. And the inverse of the relation contains the points negative 4, 1, 0, 2, 1, 3, and negative 1, 6. Finally, it's important to understand the following relationship between the graph of a relation and its inverse. If we draw a diagonal line through the coordinate system, which is the line that has the equation y equals x, notice that the relation and its inverse are mirror images of each other in this line. In other words, the inverse of a relation is the reflection of the original relation in the line y equals x.